So I want to talk a little bit about why we teach what we do and how we decide what to teach. The, I anybody, the idea that sort of what one man can do, another man can do, anyone ever heard that? Without, you know, and I don't want to get into the source of that, but the, the quote itself is absolute fucking bullshit. I want you guys to keep that in mind. There are two kinds of game. There is the game that applies to just about anybody. That's based on female psychology, social dynamics, you know, and some other psych psych psychological and sociological things that we get into. That's the stuff that goes into a book like Magic Bullets. That's the kind of stuff that goes into the love systems inside. But there's also a separate kind of game that's specific to you and your identity. That's why we got you guys all here. If we didn't have to meet you, we could just publish a book and you guys could, everybody could be awesome with women, we'd do that. But we bring you guys off here because we gotta personalize this to you. We gotta make this work to you. We gotta take the system in Magic Bullets, explain it, practice it, and personalize it. There is a ton of stuff that I do in field that's based on either the way I look, or my identity, or my build, or my history that I wouldn't dream of teaching to somebody because I might not work for them. Similarly, there's lots of stuff that some of our instructors do that I would never be able to get away with. You know, a lot of the amogging, cocky, aggressive, shit disturbing stuff, I can get punched if I try that, because I'm a big guy. You know, it's okay to fight. If you got some little Dennis the Menace type, you know, you want to be able to do that, it can work. So, and this goes, through the super conference, but through anything you're gonna learn in dating science or pickup or seduction. Consider the source, anything you learn, and try to figure out, does this, is this something that works for that person, or are they on to something universal? That's why we explicitly don't follow the guru approach. We have 21 trained instructors from Sweden to Thailand. We got them from you know, 20s, late 30s, even a little bit beyond. Guys that like every kind of women. We got white guy, we got white instructors, we got black instructor, we got Hispanic instructor, we got East Asian instructor, we got South Asian instructor, I mean most of them are here this weekend. Short, you know, short little guys, me, um, lots of different backgrounds. And when we find something that we like, we test it amongst all of us. You know, we live around the world. And if it's something that kind of universally seems to work, then we teach it. But the idea, you can go really wrong by just following something that works for one person and just blindly trying to repeat that. So that's part of our love, you know, love systems approach. Is we test the hell out of everything and we divide stuff into, okay, this works because it's something kind of universal or it works if you also have this, this, and this. So when we start to contextualize stuff or make stuff sound a little bit more complicated, that's why we're doing it. 